Hey guys, today I'll be showing you the new iMovie 10.1.3 update. The big feature in this update is support for the touch bar in the newly released MacBook Pro. According to the change log in the update, the touch bar includes quick shortcuts to frequently used actions such as importing, splitting, and adjusting a clip. It also includes more advanced shortcuts such as picture-in-picture, -picture, green screen, and side-by-side -side video effects. This update also includes a new feature in the iMovie Preferences panel that lets you delete render files in order to free up disk space. The render files themselves are stored in the project and event folders inside the iMovie library file. These files can make your project timeline run more smoothly and reduce overall lag in the app. If you delete the render files with the new option, inside the iMovie Preferences window, the files in these folders will disappear. Nothing inside the project though is deleted, it's just the cache files that take up extra space. This feature is a feature that is inside of Final Cut Pro 10, and it does help free up disk space when you need it. So that's basically the iMovie 10.1.3 update. Thank you for watching this iMovie update video. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.